want to go over a few little bits about the different uh, styling razors that Feather have. So you can see here we have three different packs. The first one is our standard blade, but this is, as you can see, the R-Type. We then have the standard blade. We then have the texturizing blade. So if I just go through the rough general details of the difference between each one of them. Obviously, the blades are to the standard and quality that Feather provides, so they're the sharpest blades that you can buy. The main difference between the three, they all fit the same, same style of razor, so um, the difference between the three is that some are more protected or have more or less of a guard than the other parts. So you can see here this one, this is our standard R-type blade. Now if you look at the difference and the amount of teeth that this has as a guard, um, is less than what we have here for our standard feather blades. So this one will be a little bit more harsh, it will be a little bit more aggressive and will remove more hair from uh, the head rather than this one will because you can see that there is less of the blade which is actually covered. So if you have a head which is really quite thick, quite heavy hair, then I would be looking more to use a blade, something similar to this. For a standard haircut um, where we're looking to thin a little bit of the hair but we don't want to take too much or we're working with anybody from medium to fine hair then this one would be more advisable. Again you can see that we actually have more teeth on this one which cover the blade. So the blade itself is exactly the same. It's all to do with the amount of coverage from the guard part here. And then we move on to this final one which is our texturizing blade. And you can see that what this has done is this is very slightly different in the way that it's almost got two teeth that are just very slightly together. So what it will do is it will mean that when we use this blade, we will take out slightly more channeled areas and more uh, textured parts rather than it being more of an even feel through here. So we can actually use this to create that little bit more of a textured feel. And this works really well to give that texture, whereas this one will generally tend to remove thickness and bulk and this one will do everything this one will, will give you texture it will also give you thickness and remove thickness and bulk but it will remove a lot more hair so again just be aware of the different types of blades that a are available and also what they are best suited for